Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much because of your great support. Please consider liking this video. When you like this video, you automatically support the work that I'm doing in this video. I've realized that you guys, you bump into the video, you watch, you go, you forget liking the video. So please do me a favor and show you like this video. This video is going to be recommended in the YouTube platform. And number two, this video is going to reach more people. So consider liking the video. I will appreciate you so much. Now, thank you so much for the like. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I told you here very clear, and I want you to mark my words, and I analyze it in the previous videos. There's nowhere Mentika Linturi is going. Mentika Linturi is not going to be impeached. Take it to the bank. There is a leaked two-hour night drama that split MPs in Lituri's probe. As the committee's meeting in the boardroom on the first floor county hall on Thursday night ended at 10 p.m. with a lot of chaos and no agreement, forcing a vote that saw the majority carrying the day, even a 15-minute break to try and arrive at a consensus flop. According to the Member of Parliament of Bumula constituency, Honorable Wamboka, walked out from the building, National Assembly, as he is claiming that this committee that was selected to investigate Meteka Linturi's probe Wamboka is claiming that this committee has already been bribed. And so don't expect anything out of what Wamboka is saying. <clears throat> Thank you. We still have some time. I will leave after this. I don't see the need to continue being here. Voting lines are so clear. Specifically on the rulings you made this morning, I had given myself to this committee, committed myself to this committee, until the two rulings you made this morning, which was so clear, so clear, if you can look at your benches, the members on the other side are leaving one by one. We will leave you to decide with the Kenyans. We will leave Kenyans to you, Kenyan farmers. Certain. Here in this video, Meteka Linturi, Cecil Mbarire, the deputy governor of Nyeri, the majority leader of the National Assembly, Kimani Ishungwa, they had a secret night meeting with William Samuel Ruto in State House. And the reason because of that meeting was to portray that the Meru people, they are so upset about the impeachment of their own, that is Mithika Linturi. Then, I'm telling you, do you expect Mithika Linturi to be impeached? At the same time, as you speak, the UDA members of parliament, they're already divided. As William Ruto, after the meeting he had with Cecil Mbarire, Mithika Linturi, the deputy governor of Nyeri, and the, uh, the, the majority leader of the National Assembly, Kimani Chungwa, they had a consensus of defending Mithika Linturi because this is not only going to bring problem to William Ruto, but also those members of parliament, 
if any case there is a member of parliament from Rift Valley that will come out and vote yes for the impeachment of Mithika Linturi. Still, you believe that Mithika Linturi is going to be impeached? Mithika Linturi is going nowhere. Take it to the bank. Why? Because we are having impunity in this government that if someone has committed a crime, he cannot be removed. Why? Because kabila yake watasema, oh, you're removing our people, or you, our own. Oh, munatoa mtu yetu natuliwa support. That is the problem that Kenyans want to tell you. Yo ujinga lazima tuwache, tuwachane na. Tuwachane ujinga kama yo. If amaluo, and my fellow luo amekua appointed, and he has committed a crime, wacha atolewa wapee mungine. Why should we have people who are continuing to delay or the derailing the development stature. At the same time, they are telling us, ati mambo ni matatu, wale watu wako corrupt. What do you think? What do you think? So, Boni Alwari is coming out to say, already on the share part of Muisi, and he has come out to name his name very clear, mythically into it. This is the video of Boni Alwari. The president, kwa vino memaliza maneno, Ya madaktari, tunataka umalize maneno ya wakulima. Wakulima wako na kesi kubwa. Sisi kama viongozi waliopikia kura katika bunge, tumefanya kazi yetu, tumeshika muizi, tumemshitaki, anaitua minister Mithika Linturi. Tunataka Mithika akienda, Mr. President Sao Uyue, the fertilizer problem was very complex. Mithika hakufanya peke yake. Alifanya na watu wengine wengi. Tunataka utoke huko. Tena hawa wengine omuluke. Hata hapa kakamega. Tuko na mtu mwenye alituguzia. Mbolea ya mawe. Kwa nyanga uchimiri fanani zibarasa. Chukwa kubira kushubira kwa subira kubira mundu. Unyana ukulele. Muriam Noko. So Kenyans. I will tell you. And I will not lie to you. I'm not here to massage anyone. Mithika linturi ya kuna mahali ataenda. Why? Because watu wake already wanaleta shida huko. The meeting that was held at State House where Cecil Mbarire, Mithika linturi, Deputy Governor of Nyeri and Kimani Shunga was present. They had a solution to protect Mithika linturi and even sponsoring individuals from Meru to come up with more priests press briefings to show they are so upset. That is whatever is happening. Again, they are complaining that if these members of parliament from Rift Valley will attempt to impeach their own, there is a big problem that is looming. And remember, Marianne Kitan, the member of parliament of Aldai, you are being told, is the ex-wife of Mithika Linturi. And she is the one who is sponsoring the impeachment. That is according to the allegations that may take a look to recede. So if you expect the Kenya Kwanza government CSS to be impeached or to be sacked, you're daydreaming. William Ruta visit all our two. Naata washa elewana. Mithika Linturi akuna maali anae. Anaenda. Why? Because already these members of parliament from Kenya Kwanza, they are gathering. And already the threat that is coming from the mountain, especially where Mithika Linturi is coming from, that is Meru. They are now showering the Rift Valley members of parliament with threats. And so these members of parliament from Rift Valley, they have been told, you must reject the impeachment of Mithika Linturi or else we break up. Or else we break up. That is what they have been told. So, the Rift Valley members of parliament, they're just going to vote to protect Mithika Linturi. Not in their hearts, but they have been affected with this fake fertilizer. And they know the root cause of this fake fertilizer. But still, look at the way the uh, the, 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 this impeachment motion is being conducted. Even that person who sponsored this motion, that is the Honorable Wamboka, the member of parliament of Bumula constituency, walked out 
He walked out cleaning. He cannot stand seeing the kind of game that is being played. And already when you compare the votes earlier on, 149 against 36, you could even see clearly that Mithikal Inturi is a man to be impeached. But why are they being protected? Or why is it that Mithikal Inturi is being protected? Because Ali Sema, Ana Ugopa Nini, Na Anafanya Na Sirikani, Na William Ruta Anajua Kazi Anafanya Hiu Ya Upusi Hiya Ya Kufanya Maskano Solomon. If it was the man to be removed, Mithikal Inturi, Na Moses Kuria Ongekua Ameshato Leo. But because we are having a punitive government, very useless government, led by William Samuel, and I'm not fearing to say that, very useless government, they are protecting crooks, thieves, stealing public resources, doing businesses, having tenders, but you cannot speak, you cannot speak, you cannot speak, because it is hustler government. That is it. So if you think that mythical injury is going to be impeached, you suffer. Forget it. And you will be shocked at that time, these people will be voting to remove Mithika or not. Utaona hizi hawa maimpisu wote, wakenya kwanza wataju, watastomi in the National Assembly. Na wataritain Mithika Nituri as the CS of agriculture. Not that they are not upset, but because they are being pushed by William Ruto after the meeting that was held in the state house. Ladies and gentlemen, what do you think? Drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to appreciate you so much because of your great support. Please consider subscribing to this channel. You like the video, you give your opinion at the comment section below, and don't forget to share this video. When you do so, you automatically support the work that I'm doing in this video. Thank you so much. Bye-bye till you meet in another video.